Can we start with you, Jim? You did a stand-up for uh, Pope Francis during his visit yes. to Philly in 2015. What was that like? Oh, well, I kind of detail it a little bit, uh, actually, in the recent special, but it was pretty absurd. It was uh, stand-up comedy before uh, the leader of the Catholic Church. So it was, in, you know, I describe it as a no-win situation. But the, then again, no, because no one's going to be leaving there saying, you know, I like the comedian. He was better than the Pope. Like, that guy should be Pope. <laughs> See, Philadelphians like to boo, too. Yeah. yeah. They didn't boo you, though, did you? Did they, they did boo. They did boo. Why? They booed me because I did a joke. It's, it's, I did a joke about the Santa Claus thing. I go, Philly loves the Pope. Um, and uh, not that you guys were that nice to Santa Claus, which is, like, from 1968. So, like, there is that Northeast. That's why we choose to live here. I love the energy. Um, but it doesn't suffer fools. So, like, there was, like, we don't care if we're seeing a religious leader who's about to usher in a year of mercy. We don't like it. <laughs> well, on behalf mean? of Philadelphia, I apologize. No, it's Did fine. You know. Did you meet the Pope? Did you get to meet him? I did meet the Pope. And I introduced my mother-in-law to the Pope. Oh, that's nice. Which means, you know, I'm in the Son-in-Law Hall of Fame. Yeah. Right? I hope you enjoyed this clip from Faith and Focus. This show is made possible by generous donors. To give your support or learn more about how you can join the conversation around faith and culture, visit americamag.org slash faithshow.